This video shows you how to enable the incremental search feature for the entire view or individual columns. You'll also learn how to perform custom actions in response to search string changes and how to initiate or end the search from code. To enable the incremental search, select the view, expand its options behavior property, and enable the allow incremental search option. Let's run the application to see this feature in action. First, search for a record by product name. Focus the corresponding column and then start typing the search text. Type C to move focus to the first row where product name starts with this character. Then type H to locate a record where the product name starts with CH and so on. There may be several rows containing cells matching the search criteria. To continue searching forward using the same criterion, press the control down arrow key combination. To return back, press control up arrow. You can also use backspace to modify the search string. In a similar manner, you can focus another column to search against its values. Close the application and disable the incremental search for one of the columns. Select the category column, expand the options column property, and set the allow incremental search option to false. And let's run the application and focus the category column to see that the incremental search doesn't work for it any longer. You can still use the feature in other columns. You might want to respond to changes in the search string while users search for records. To do this, handle the view's key up event. In the event handler, call the display incremental search text method, which in turn obtains the current search text using the view's get incremental text method and displays this string in the status bar and run the application to see the result. Let's start the incremental search to see the status bar display the current search string. You can also initiate or end incremental search operations from code. The ribbon already has the start incremental search and stop incremental search buttons that will be used for this purpose. In the first button's click event handler, call the view's start incremental search method and pass the CHA text as a parameter. Display this text to the status bar using the previously discussed display incremental search text method. Don't forget to focus to the product name column via the view's focused column property. The click event handler for the second button simply calls the stop incremental search method. And run the application. When you click the Start Incremental Search button, the grid locates the nearest record where the product name starts with CHA and displays this text in the status bar. You can continue typing to narrow down the search. The Stop Incremental Search button disables the incremental search mode. And that's it. Thanks for watching, and thank you for choosing DevExpress.